pleasure to tell you that I have now completed the Couch to 5K program. I was using the CG5K free app um, by Zen Labs and I was able to jog for a full 30 minutes without stopping. Hurrah! <laughs> I'm really happy that I'm now able to jog. I can say that I can jog at 30 minutes non-stop. The last five minutes was actually quite tiring. Um, I didn't expect it to be after my run at the weekend outside, but um, I jogged up 4.1 miles per hour for the full 30 minutes. Um, I didn't speed up and I didn't slow down. But after the first 25 minutes, I started to feel it and I'm thinking, oh, please come to the end, come to the end quickly. Um, but yeah, I soldiered on through it and um, I was able to complete it. So including the five minute warm up and cool down, I did a total of 2.69 miles. So I think um, I, I walk at 3.2 miles, so my warm up and cool down is 3.2 miles per hour, which makes it about 0.6 miles for the two. So I'm actually jogging two miles in the 30 minutes. So if I could jog for the full 3.1 miles, it would probably take me 45, 46 minutes. But I know for a fact that after that 30 minutes, I wouldn't be able to carry on. So I'll carry on jogging without a break. So I'll probably need to um, stop, uh, walk at the five minute, at the 30, 30 minute marker again, and then resume jogging for the, for the remainder of the run. So that will be my plan for um, for my race, which is on Saturday. I'm going to go up uh, down to Bank Street in Ottawa to pick up my race kit and I get a Santa Shuffle jumper as well. I uh, purchased for $15. And so I'll be running in that. Oh, it'll be under my coat though because it's the snow hasn't got away yet and it's due to snow again um, later this week. So see how that goes. But so it leaves me, it's now Tuesday, so it leaves me Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, three three more days, or two more days, I should say, to run. So three more days total, but probably two more. I probably could fit in two more runs, but my plan would normally be uh, run every other day. So I would normally run on Thursday and then Saturday, so... Just one more run. So if I can fit that run in, because I do actually have plans on Thursday, um, my plan would be to see how far I can run if I slow down the jog for the full 3.1 miles um, and see that how, how that goes. So I'm just so happy to have done it. Um, who would have believed that running one minute at a time eight weeks ago and now running at 30 minutes it's just unbelievable it's such a great program recommend it to anyone any of the couch to 5k programs are really good it just helps you to build up that stamina to keep you going and um it's a great sense of achievement as well to to think that somebody i'm not i wouldn't say i'm unfit I'm overweight for sure, but I'm not unfit. I've been doing like walks as well, long walks beforehand. I was walking when the weather was better at lunchtime, about five, six K over the hour, just over an hour at lunch. So I'm not unfit totally. So I'm not totally a couch potato, but definitely I'm not the fittest person ever. And that tells you by the time that I'm gonna complete the 5K. I'm not doing it in 30 minutes, but you know, it's, there's a start. You've got to start from somewhere, and uh, this this program has really really helped me. Um, I just can't even believe that I've completed eight weeks consistently without real break. I mean, I think I delayed a few days, but once I got into the swing of it, I actually um, did it every other day instead of just three times a week. So I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of the achievement. I'm I'm proud of completing. And I look forward to the race on Saturday. So this will be my last Couch to 5K update, of course, because it's completed. 
I will probably come back to you and tell you how I did in the race and then after that um, I will just go back to my normal day-to-day -day business on YouTube so I'll update you with my hair lock uh, journey and maybe if I decide to do other programs I did purchase the insanity um, program I was in Target the other day and it was on sale <laughs> So I thought, oh, let me buy it. I don't think I'll start it straight away because I'm due to go home uh, for Christmas to England for three weeks. So I probably won't do it then. So I may, I might start it and then just take a break and then restart it when I come back. Or I might just wait till I come back. But I don't think I'll update you like I have with this program because I did try doing P90X a while back and I only lasted two weeks. So I don't want to inflict that on you again. But if I do, I, I will personally record i won't post unless i achieve the full maybe if i achieve the f first month i'll do an update and then the 60 day update i'll do that but don't hold your breath <laughs> but um yeah so that's me thanks for all the people who watched i hope this has helped you uh either with your runs or decide to take up uh, the Couch to 5K program, as well as other brilliant videos out there, and um, good luck in your um, in your journeys. And for the last time, I'm going to say, keep running. Take care. Bye.